Women will now be able to contribute to our mission in ways they could not before. They'll be allowed to drive tanks, fire mortars, and lead infantry soldiers into combat. And everything else that was previously open only to men. Allowed in combat? What do you think I was doing over there? I wasn't playing Legos. I wasn't sitting at the fob pushing papers. Like, I was in a war zone. We'd be flying 50 feet over enemy territory. I was always attached to infantry and armor. I was a power generator mechanic. I'm a veteran, 11 years military police. The stuff that we do for veterans in the United States sucks. So I get to the VA and I tell them, you know, I'm a veteran. And so they said, well, we only have services for male veterans. I go from the lieutenant to in the army and in the blink of an eye, I'm homeless. And it's strictly because of my gender. We also serve. We also die for our country. Like our guys aren't the only ones coming home with PTSD. We left a name. So we're going to create this event and we're going to create this spokesperson you know, let people know what the issues are for women veterans. Welcome to the Miss Veteran America competition. We're part of something bigger than ourselves. Miss Veteran America is a voice. We are not second class veterans. We are not damsels in distress. We are warriors. This is the woman that I want representing my country, the woman who was willing to raise her right hand and die for it. Oh, 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 oh.